what's been on my mind Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light Hey darling We could get out of town See the beautiful world around Wanna see it now And get in that car Leave a little note and we'll drive real far Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog and happy Monday uh, Today is 18 of October uh, Last week I didn't film anything because I... Um, we had a very short week in terms of work because uh, Monday and Tuesday were holidays so I decided to take this week uh, off of blogging because I also I wanted to um, try new things with the camera, practice uh, for the blogs and you know um, all this stuff that I always told you uh, in the blogs that I try to find new ways to make the videos. Uh, this morning I have been finishing some changes for uh, the book cover uh, that sent me last week so <clears throat> I was also was working on the changes last week and I just sent them uh, today, um, this morning. So basically the morning I have been working on the changes and also, you know, making some bread because if you remember in the last vlog, I told you that I was starting to make my own bread. So this week we have a lot of things to do. Uh, one of the things that I want to do with you is try the Morphone acrylic paints. Uh, remember they sent them a few weeks ago uh, I also blog it <laughs> and um, and I want to try and see how it looks and maybe we can do this together also I want to finish Tiana and also I wanted to finish this with you because I already shared with you the sketching process so I wanted to do like the painting thing also with you so you can see like all the process um, of a print more or less I'm sure I'm going to explain this more in the future because um, you know I'm going to do more prints and more things um, but for now I think you can make an idea of how I'm working and this afternoon guys I think um, I'm going to package uh, automate the packages for my patreon snail mail it's going late um, the September one is going late, so I need to really work harder this week in Patreon as Neil Mid here, you know. I need to finish Tiana, I need to make the uh, sticker also, and, uh, and another thing I plan to do. Uh, so basically this is the work we are going to do this week. And painting uh, the three Inktobers that I have left. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to paint all them uh, this week, but at least I want to do one of them more or two, maybe one. Let's say not not set it. Let's not set um, super big expectations just in case. Hope you had guys a nice weekend. I did. Um, we did a workshop on Patreon on Saturday, um, showing how to work with the digital wash. Um, you know to recreate like a digital effect um, on for for wash for wash, 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 for wash uh, and it was very nice to catch up with my patrons um, also the recording is available on the page uh, just in case you want to join and you want to see uh, this workshop and, and guys let's do uh, some printing and some labeling and preparing some envelopes uh, for my patrons
guys. I was thinking uh, maybe I make a stamp for the Happy Mail patron uh, thing to put on the on the envelopes, uh, or maybe I change um, the stickers. You know, I don't like. I mean. I think I need to change it. I have 12 left, so I think for the next one I'm going to change this. Uh, maybe we can design something together. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to put all the um, addresses here. I'm going to print everything with this cute machine that's super dusty right now. Um, but I'm going to do that. Uh, so yeah, let's go for this, guys. <laughs> Okay guys, let's try these uh, acrylic paints, uh, acrylic brushes or markers. Uh, these are the colors we have. Um, so basically what I'm going to do first is uh, make a color page uh, just to see how they look. Uh, because I'm not very sure that they look the same as printed. And these are all the 24 um the 24 markers that comes in this package um it is medium tip so i'm going to show you right now how it is let's go for making first the color page Okay guys, this is the colors, uh, how they look. I think they have very nice color and also you can make super cool um, color combinations. You have a lot of greens, blues, also purples, uh, red, uh, two different type of yellows and orange. Also uh, this very dark pink, um, ivory, uh, it's like, I mean, you, you see it more pink, uh, but it's like an ivory color, um, the white, the black. I'm pretty happy of how they uh, look at first, um, but I think is that I need to test on paper, you know, on a drawing. So let me sketch something and I come back to paint it with the Morphone acrylic pens. Okay guys, I came up with this sketch. I have made uh, this one before because I don't know if I want to put some flowers uh, on top, uh, but basically I want to create this type of clouds to paint everyone on different color and uh, work with the uh, Game Boy design. Um, because I really want to do something with Game Boy because I have very good... <laughs> um, memories uh, of being of playing with a Game Boy when I was um, little. Also Luis um, is a very fan of the retro retro uh, consoles and everything so I want to to do something similar to this. Uh, I cut some paper. I'm going to use um, the Bristol uh, XL Bristol paper. It's for illustration. I'm not sure how it's going to work with the markers because I think I never use it for markers. I know, I mean, for acrylic markers. Um, this is the paper you have to use or people recommend you to use if you're going to work with alcohol-based markers. So this time I decided to go with this paper. You see, it's not very thick. Um, so let's see how it works, guys.
I've got the sketch. Uh, finally, uh, the size is an A5. I had to erase a little bit, guys, because I'm not very used to <laughs> to work with paper. But I think I like how it looks. And now is the moment where I am very, very scary because I know I'm going to start ruining everything. So what I'm going to do first is try to compound a color palette here like very very fast uh, with some colors and see what happens you know make little captures um, with different colors and see how it works and then I'm going to paint this baby Snowflakes are coming down Collapse into water when they hit the ground I hear the sound of empty streets Yesterday has gone to sleep So all that's left is you and me This is the final version guys, uh, what do you think? I think that I finally get up with the colors I wasn't very sure at the beginning Remember the small uh, swatches that I made? I was thinking first we need like in this uh, ivory color, but I'm so happy I choose this blue. Also, I had to use um, this color from the Posca because I needed like a darkened color for this blue. Uh, also, um, maybe it's the paper, I don't know. But in the first swatches I made, remember, I did this one, you can see it guys, uh, this is the blue, I use it on, you know, on the illustration, uh, but here, clear, clearly, I see it very blue, and here I see it very green, um, so, I don't know, I'm, I'm happy with the results, uh, for sure. It's the first time I'm doing something like this with this type of uh, acrylic brushes. I decided uh, last time, uh, I mean last minute, to make some, you know, to put more of this uh, dark lilac or dark purple uh, here to create more contrast because um, it was going to be like the same colors all the time, so I prefer to create more, uh, you know, contrast. And yeah, guys, I'm so happy. Uh, I have to say that I work so happy with these um, markers, uh, the Morphone markers. <clears throat> Sorry, guys, here they are. I have to say, guys, that maybe the Bristol paper, it's not the best to work with it. Um, I got some, you know, these type of lines, but it's not about the markers because... Um, I paint, also I have some Posca pens and I have the same problem, so I think it's the paper. I need to make some research and see which paper can use um, for, you know, for getting better. Hi guys, happy Thursday. Um, yesterday I didn't film anything, um, very sorry. <laughs> but by the morning I was making like uh, house cleaning and folding clothes that I have a lot of laundry to fold and you know, save, save. I didn't, I didn't know how to say that, save in the closet. Um, I think it's save in the closet, but and I didn't want to film uh, this because, you know, this is an art, uh, this is an art block and not a house cleaning block. Um, so I decided to take the day off filming. And today uh, I have some things to do. Uh, this morning I have been doing uh, some changes on the book. Uh, also, guys, hope you are following all this process because um, you see how much time it's taking. Uh, doing the cover. I mean, it's been more than a month right now 
and I have been making lots of small changes or they're bigger so when you work in a project take in mind these things guys because you see I have been working if you follow the three latest blogs um, I have been talking about the cover and the cover changes so yeah take this in mind and I hope that by sharing this with you if you are interested in the in an artist career or an illustration career uh, you can make an idea of how a work of an illustrator it is um, so that's the, the mainly um, I think that's the mainly end of these blogs like having an idea of how an illustrator works illustrator of how an illust how an illustrator works and and yeah and follow my job around for today guys I have a couple of things to do um, I want to draw to make the draw with me video for my patrons so this is what I'm going to do right now after closing this conversation with you guys um, and the next thing is put some color to um, to the next uh, the next uh, the next inktober you know guys we are today today is 21 by the way and we have to post the wand uh, the wand prom so I need to I don't remember guys I'm very very bad with this I don't remember what which is the next one um, so I need to paint I think this is a six I think it's a seven <laughs> I'm not sure um, so yeah I need to make it because uh, my plan my initial plan of have all of them um, done before October uh, you see it's not possible um, so the time it's scaring me, it's getting me um, it's getting closer to what I have so right now I need to work as fast as possible in the next couple ones you know the next one and the next one um, so hope today and tomorrow I can do that so it will be very fine because I will have like a week to work in the last one and yeah I don't want to bother you more with my boring conversation so let's go and do some art guys this is a drawing I'm going to paint in the draw with me video uh, it's from Roy De Art draw this in your style and uh, I decided that I'm going to use a more painterly style instead of the wash because it's been a while since I paint with this and I really love I mean it's a technique I really want to continue practicing um, so yeah I'm going to do that right now it's a, qu a quarter to 1 p.m. Uh, I think I will be able to have it not ready all today uh, maybe I have to do it in two times let's see how far I can go uh, with this one this is where I got so far for the draw this in your style uh, also it is the um, uh, draw with me video for my patrons I have been one hour and a half more or less uh, doing this and talking I mean I wasn't explaining a lot of things um, but I was talking about films I'm watching <laughs> and thoughts I have while I am painting uh, it's very difficult guys to speak and draw at the same time so uh, obviously today that I'm not having like the best English day ever so I'm not very eloquent while talking and I did my best um, I'm going to film now the second part of this I uh, probably it's going to be another half an hour and a half uh, but without voice so I'm going to edit first I'm just trying to save the file and and this thing uh, and also I have to share the audio I made um, because I'm trying different uh, audio for that so I'm going to edit the first part and then I'm going to finish the second part that's going to be uh, drawing without talking so I think I like how it looks um, right now this is uh, the original I I remember I, I think I show you guys I don't remember right now uh, I love the color combination so out of my comfort zone I mean in a regular basis I will never paint with this uh, canary uh, yellow but I like it I like how it's um, the result how it's looking I still have to work all the um, all the air and put more shadows and more stuff but basically more or less I have the face um, 
more or less because I need to be done but yeah so okay guys I see you tomorrow Hi guys, happy Friday! Um, yesterday I filmed not that much, uh, but today uh, I want to paint the October number 7, I think it's a 7. So I'm going to do that this morning, I mean also I need to do a reels, so probably you're not going to see it. I will try to catch or to film some uh, images with the phone so you can see a little bit of the process. And, and well, um, I wanted to set up like a big uh, to do task with, <laughs> with things, but I'm going to make it like more manageable. Uh, let's go step by step and see what we can do, okay? First I wanted to show you the last, uh, the result of the Draw With Me, no sorry, the well the Draw With Me video for Patreons and also um, uh, the final version of Roy the Arts uh, Draw This New Style. Uh, it took me over all the afternoon to do that. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty happy with the result. I have been a lot, a long time without painting, you know, uh, with this more painterly style, and I really enjoy it and have and had a good afternoon <laughs> doing that. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to share it on Instagram. Uh, I don't know, guys. I really love how the face ended up looking. I changed some things uh, from the sketch to the beginning uh, because these I were too big. But yeah, pretty happy. Uh, also, I need to update right now. First thing to do, um, the the two videos uh, of one is one is from one hour and a half, and the other is like two hours. And I want to upload them to uh, Patreon. And this is the first I'm going to do. And next, I'm going to put the setup here, uh, put the setup to make the reels. Hi guys, happy Monday. Hope every one of you is doing well. Um, uh, it's me editing the video and I realized that I didn't say goodbye properly. So I want to say goodbye and I want to say thank you guys for being here, for watching my videos. Also, thank you to my patrons because they are amazing and I couldn't ask for a better Patreon community, if you're honest. Um, they let me the time to work in projects, to film these videos, also... They helped me to uh, get better or uh, update my filming setup and all these things. And yeah, I'm, I can ask for better patrons, being honest. And if you are not Patreon, uh, you don't have to become a Patreon. Uh, for me, it's enough that you watch my videos, that you like my videos. And if you didn't subscribe yet, uh, subscribe. So this way I can make more videos in YouTube. So say that, guys. Uh, wish you a nice week. I'm going to start recording right now the next vlog. Um, so yeah, see you here in the next vlog, guys. Bye-bye.